We're extremely grateful for the amazing backers from our first generation product, Spud. We have made game-changing advances on our patented technology. Splay is brighter, higher resolution, yet lighter, and has a smaller form factor. It also has a brand new projector mode. We developed three major innovations. The material science for the only high quality, fully flexible projection screen. The only ultra short throw portable projector. And ruggedized and easy to use retractable arms for quick expansion and collapsing. With our supply chain set up and our R&D complete, we only need your support. First thing with your splay is you'll want to take it out of the case, so you just unzipper it there. And then you have your fully packed up splay. Popping up splay is really easy. You just push out this slider on the back, and then it's expanded. Uh, turning on and off splay is super simple. You just hold in the button that has the power logo on it for just a few seconds and you'll see the LEDs turn on, so it tells you your splay is turning on. The main functions for splay will start from the top of the chassis. There's the slider, which you use for expanding and uh, storing your splay. There's the focus adjustment here, so you just go left and right to get that perfect image. There's also the projector mode to display mode button, so you just tap this and you go easily between projector mode and display mode. The brightness, uh, increase or decrease, the sound, and then the main connection interface, so the HDMI for video, the USB-C for power, and the USB port for using as a power bank or for charging the wireless adapter. You can also use Splay as a power bank. You just connect it through the USB port on the back of Splay, and then you can just charge your device. You can easily connect to any device through HDMI or HDMI adapter. You can also connect easily to a wireless adapter like Chromecast or the Microsoft wireless adapter by plugging in through the USB side and the HDMI side of the wireless adapter. And then you're using your display wirelessly. You want to adjust the focus to make sure you're getting the best image possible. So you just move the focus slider on the back, find the best focus right there, and then your focus is adjusted. Brightness is really easy to do. You just go down, and then you get lower brightness but longer battery life. And then when you're in brighter environments, you can increase the, the brightness like that. You can easily increase or decrease the volume until you get it as loud as you want. If you want to move the image location, uh, for example, if you want to move it up, you would pull down on the, the shroud, and then you can see the image becomes shifted upwards. Going from display mode to projector mode is easy. First, you flip over your splay, unzipper the shroud, unbuckle the buckle, unclasp the clasps, and then you want to Fold back your splay and remove the arms from the arm holders inside. So unlatch the display part of splay from the projector part of splay, which is now done. And then you just pull the projector through, and then you're back into having splay as the projector mode. Projector mode's an awesome way to get an even bigger image than display mode when you have access to a wall. So we can just turn on display now. And we see the image is flipped because it defaults to display mode. 
but we just press this button here to flip back to projector mode. Then you have an even bigger image that's corrected. And if you want to shift the image up, you can just tilt the projector. And we have this automatic keystone correction to keep the image flat. So you can tilt it like that or go down. And that's how projector mode works. To put display back from projector mode to display mode, you just slide through, reclass the four corners of the arms here. And you want to put the fabric and the screen back around. You then clasp the, the clasp on the back, so that is now collapsed here. And then pop up your, your display. And then unzipper it. Pull it back in. Clasp it together. And then you're back in display mode. Cleaning the screen is really easy. You can just take a piece of tape and you just slide it against the screen and it will pick up any dust that happened to attach to the screen. It's easy to clean the lens. Just use a microfiber cloth. And just wipe the lens. Packing splay is very easy. You just pull back the slider to fold up your splay. And then you could just put it in the protective case. And then you just zipper up the protective case. And your splay is good to go with you. So if there's any doubts that this is a real demo, you can see we push in here. Uh, the product works. It's extremely bright. It's high resolution. And it's a real working product.